They have this big dramatic pour of their water and I wish I knew what the actual jug was called. I think what COVID has taught us is that this is something we need in our lives. I remember I had went after to meet up with one of my girlfriends and just the people in the restaurant, how excited they were that the Raptors were going in the right direction. And uh, it was just cool to see people from all parts of Toronto being that excited in that one moment in Tabuli. It's absolutely heartbreaking seeing what a lot of these small businesses have been through. They're the backbone, they're the heart and soul. So I think they just make you appreciate you know, their hard work and what they've done for this city so much more after everything we've been through. Hey Tabuli, it is Kate Burness and I am here today because MasterCard has given me this incredible opportunity to feature your restaurant and also send one of your amazing dishes to one of our incredible frontline workers. From a personal standpoint, I cannot wait to be back at the restaurant, back on that little back patio and eating my favorite dish, the kefta, and no surprise, that is the dish that I will be sending to the frontline worker. So thank you so much for creating amazing takeout. We are gonna support you as much as possible. And as mentioned, cannot wait to be back with myself and my friends and can't wait to see how the frontline worker likes the food. We're so happy. Um, Kate's lovely. She's been a regular and supporter for years and all our staff and, and management know her really well and we're really, really excited to, to be part of this. And thank you, Kate. When you come to Tabuli, it's not just about the food, it's about the whole experience and being part of something bigger. Everything is made in-house, fresh from scratch, and uh, we use traditional recipes that have been passed down from generations that we've worked on and improved. I remember when we first opened, people were coming in and thanking us and actually bringing us flowers. It was just so, such a great feeling. And then with the pandemic, that's when I really, really also saw the love and support from the neighborhood we've had. In 16 years of business, I can honestly say it, it almost broke us. Just the overwhelming support has just been incredible. They welcome you and it's everything right from the start at this restaurant that makes you fall in love with it. I always get the dip trio personally, the labne, the baba ganoush, and also the hummus, and I get it with their pita bread. But if I had to pick my favorite main, it would definitely be the kefta, along with the vegetables and the rice. So I think with the appetizer and the main meal, it is the absolute perfect combination. The best part of Tabuli is there really is something for everyone. I know I'm sending this dish to a frontline worker, and when I speak about small businesses, I think my level of appreciation is just as much for all those people that are currently working on the front lines of this pandemic. I just want to say thank you. Mmm, it's delicious. Oh, that is so good. Pomegranates on it. Mm. I'm definitely going to visit them when they reopen. Oh, absolutely. I just, I really miss the restaurant atmosphere, you yeah. know, when you're able to just, you know, sit down with your friends and just chill out and absolutely. share a meal. At the beginning of the pandemic, I don't think I could look at another donut. <laughs> <laughs> just such a generous gift, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. really nice. One of my favorite parts of living in Toronto is the fact that it's so multicultural. I think we have some of the best food, honestly, on the planet. The day we actually get to go back into the restaurant and do it for real, I think we will never take it for granted again.